oh the box is so pretty and I broke a nail but that's fine that's fine hey guys welcome back so as you saw in my previous video i did broke my nail but it's okay because we are going to fix it today so this will last me until my nail will grow a little bit longer so i can cut that and without any further ado let's begin all right so we all know the og trick using a tea bag to fix a broken nail but i like to do an extra step to make sure that will last me until my nail will grow so i can um, cut that part so this is the items that you're going to need i forgot to include the nail glue because i'm going to use a nail glue so what you want to do next is to cut small pieces from the tea bag and make sure they fit perfectly the broken parts so take your time So as you can see I cut two very small pieces and I'm going to uh, put them on top of this nail file so I can see them and next I'm going to go with my glue this is a nail glue from my pressed on nails and I'm going to apply just a tiny bit on the broken part and then I'm going to spread it around with this uh, stick. Next I'm going with a piece of paper and you want to make sure that it's very soaked with the glue because that way we won't get any lifted edges, any bumps. So I'm going again with a little bit more of this nail glue and then with my stick I want to make sure that I smooth everything out. So I'm going to do that until the nail glue dries out. So once that nail glue dried out, I'm going to go with my nail file and I'm going to buff a little bit that out because I want a very smooth surface. Next I'm going to apply one coat of this semi-permanent base coat and then I'm going to cure that for 2 minutes in my LED lamp. I like to do this extra step because I want to make sure that everything is sealed in there. Sometimes warm water can dissolve the nail glue. So I want to make sure this will last me at least one week until my nail will grow. And next I'm going to repeat the process. So I'm going to go with more nail glue with my other piece of paper. And I let that dry. And of course I'm going to file that a little bit more because as I said I want to have a very smooth surface and after that I'm going to apply two coats of this uh, semi-permanent base and that's it And make sure you cure well every coat so after I did that I'm going to remove that sticky residue with nail polish remover and I swear to you this will last you at least one week if not more and yeah my nail is fixed it looks nice it feels nice as you can see here so next I'm going to paint my nail like nothing happened and uh, that's it I hope you guys enjoyed my video please subscribe if you haven't already take care and I will see you in my next one. Mwah.